First Communion, Picasso faces a large format work for the first time. The canvas was painted in the workshop of the painter José Garnaloalda, where Picasso went, on his father's instructions, to complete his training. The painting of Garnalo, teacher and friend of José Ruiz, and brother of one of Picasso's colleagues at the Lydia, was specialized in religious and moralizing themes, which is why Picasso found in his studio all the liturgical objects of reference for this composition. began his painting career with a very traditional academic approach, schooled by his art professor father, and was already fairly masterful by his early teens. He painted First Communion when he was 14 years old. It clearly shows his ability to render a highly realistic scene. The fabric glows with light and flows naturalistically over the girl, his sister Lola. The subject is unambiguous. The subject matter is unambiguous. It has all the trappings of classical, academic art. This is a painting that was designed to appeal to the conservative taste of a juried... Throughout his life, people who met Picasso were taken aback by the intensity of his eyes, an enduring legacy of his southern Spanish heritage. There was this strange Andalusian phrase, it's called Mirada Fuerte, but what it's about, the strong gaze, to possess an object with his eyes. One of his early friends said they were amazed that Picasso, when he looked at a piece of paper, there was anything left because the eyes were so strong. They sort of, uh, it seemed as if he was going to burn the image off the paper.